Hey Collective, and welcome back to my channel, Empress Intuition 1111. I hope you guys are all doing well and having such a beautiful afternoon. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, hey girl, hey boy. So we're going to go ahead and hop into the current energy. Any dark magic point being thrown at me or my channel, make it all fall down and turn out for my highest good, period. And I call upon all my archangels to protect me while I channel the messages for the collective. We're going to start out with the channel messages and downloads I was getting. Someone could be inappropriately touching people at work. And you could have homecoming coming up. If you have a teenager, this message is not for everyone. But if you have a teenager or a high schooler, they could be going to homecoming this weekend. Ooh, that's very fun and exciting, period. Let you know that you're doing something right. Okay, you're raising them well, he or she. And someone could be on feet finders. They could have a feet fetish or a foot fetish or something like that. And Halloween is the devil's day. We're going to talk about that in a different video, though. And happy birthday if it's your birthday. And you could have just got a new job or quit one. And someone's car recently broke down. You could be having maintenance issues. This could be at work or at your apartment. And your landlord could be really shitty or crappy. I just seen 112. And um, you have nosy neighbors all up in your business trying to figure out what you got going on because you different. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and hop into the tea. Let's see what's tea for my collective. Holy Spirit, take the will and lead the way. Let my collective know what they need to know today. We have someone holding on way too tight or someone owes you some kind of money and they don't want to pay it to you. Okay. It could be a king of swords. This could be an air sign that's holding back. It could be an air sign or an earth sign that's holding back some money from you. I just seen 145. Yeah, this could be three of cups. Someone could be partying with your cash at this time, having fun with your money, with the money they owe you. This could be a past lover. I just seen the lover card. Yeah, with the hangman, someone feels stuck. I just seen 202. They're playing with your money, but they feel stuck in the situation. Mm -hmm. Somebody is feeling stuck. I just seen 212. Yeah, this could be a past lover, like I was saying. Someone that you used to date. They could owe you like some child support money, some kind of inheritance, daycare fees. I just seen 222. Yeah, you're the high priestess. You intuitively know this. Pisces energy. Your baby daddy, baby mama can owe you some money. What does the collective need to know? I just seen 233. Current energy for the collective. Okay. Something with the sun card. You could be very happy, very blissful. 247 or something's coming to the light. Yeah, you're in a seven of pentacles energy. You're thinking about your finances, your money. This king of wands owe you some money. And you know that. You're wondering when is he going to come in and give you what he owe you, period. Yeah, with the nine of wands, other people know about it. They're watching. They're seeing if you're going to go towards this person and give it to them. Or they're seeing, have you done this already? <clears throat> yeah, with the nine of pentacles, someone knows you're in the nine of pentacles. Or whatever they owe you, whatever money this king of wands owes you um, is going to take you out of the seven of pentacles and put you into the nine of pentacles. And they know that. That's why they're not giving it to you, period. Somebody's holding back some sort of fortune from you. Hold on, let's relight this infant. And remember, only take these messages how they resonate. I would like for you to subscribe and hit that, that post notification bell so you always know when I upload. And to like this video if it's resonating with you or someone around you as well. You might have to take somebody to court, 345, or somebody might have already recently been to court for a recent situation or something like that. Okay. We're going to pull a couple more. What is the energy for my collective? The King of Cups, the water sign. Yeah, someone says everything is fine, but it's not. I just seen 404. Someone is pretending like they're okay, but they're not. They're wearing a mask. They put up a facade. They might dress nice or wear nice clothes. But you're a badass being full of love and life and possibilities. Through this deck, it may bring you, it may bring you and help you find your path and lead you to your best self. So whatever I'm telling you is guiding you to your best self, period. Yeah, I see the devil at the bottom of the deck. That's Capricorn energy. So a Capricorn could owe an air sign some money or a water sign some money. Yeah, this person's feeling stuck with the hangman page of swords. Somebody's watching, somebody knows, or somebody wants to send a message, an air sign with the sun. Something's being illuminated or something's being told or something recently came to the light. Or you really don't give a fuck about the money. You're just very happy in the blissful energy and the sun energy. This could be your energy as well, collective. 
take it how it resonates. Yeah, Queen of Swords. You could be an air sign, like I said. So I feel like there's a King of Wands that owns, a, um, yeah, the Ten of Cups. So basically, this person knows this Vir Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or Libra. Libra. What the heck? I can't talk today. This Gemini, Libra, Aquarius knows that they owe you some money. This Earth sign or this Air sign. They know that they owe you your money. It'll bring you to the Ten of Cups. It'll make you really happy. 535. And people are watching. There could be a person that they're dealing with that's watching them watch you to see if they're going to give you this money. Two more Holy Spirit. We're in the 1010 portal or an upcoming 1010 portal. You know, it's karmic endings. But yeah, this person's holding on to your money. Like I said, this was the first card that was at the top of the deck when we first started. So yeah, there's a Capricorn that owes an air sign some money. An air sign or a water sign, some money, period. Yep, an air sign or a water sign. But there's a queen of wands that doesn't want you to get it. But with the six of wands, you must be in like the spotlight. You took the lead. You already got money. So this person might not want to pay you because they feel like you already got money. Ten of swords, everything is not fine. They feel like if they give you this money, they'll be broke or they won't have what they need. But it doesn't matter because they owe you child support. So they shouldn't really look at it like that it's not about how much you have it's what the fuck they owe okay that's what i'm getting right now i feel like there's a lot of karmics involved as well yeah with the eight of cups you left a situation behind 646 or you're going to you're walking to your destiny eight of pentacles you're working on your money this is why they don't want to give you your money because they feel like you're working on your money and you already have money. Ace of Swords, that's the truth. That's why they're holding back from you. Yeah, they're holding back from this Queen of Cups. You could be a water sign with the Knight of Cups. They might feel like a Knight of Cups could be helping you or assisting you. Temperance, they're taking their slow-ass sweet time to come in and give you what they owe you. Hmm. Let's go to the career deck. Yeah, offerings. This person might try to come in and give you like a small offer. You could have cut this person off, 722. This could be somebody from your past. Yeah, the future. They know your future is bright. You have a lot of flexibility at this time. And people want to come in and offer you things. So this is why this person don't want to come in and help you or give you what they owe you. Because you don't really need help. It's just what they owe you. They're just holding back from paying you what they owe you. It don't have to be child support. It could just be like you, they could be staying with you and they owe you like some past rent. They could be, like you know I'm saying, they have to pay a bill like half on a bill or something but i'm really picking up like on child support like a mother energy like this could be a mother figure this could be inheritance as well i feel like this person has been like keeping the checks and stuff like that we talked about this in another video so you have to go scroll and watch the video that talks about like stolen child support money the checks going to somebody else i should have got the kipler deck but i think we'll be good with the modern witch okay let's see what's going on yeah, reflection. This person's reflecting on how they're treating you because they know they're treating you like shit and they owe you something. Yeah, they wanted something more long term. But this person's really immature, really childish. And they know a lot of good luck is on your side. This person could have tried to limit at you, but they're also very chaotic and drama, like a drama king or queen. I don't really feel like they're fit for marriage or fit for something long term. And this person could also be doing magic on you to keep you feeling stuck and stagnant within your career. Or try to slow down your finances or something. They're mad because you have gifts. You have abilities to create is also what I'm picking up on. Holy Spirit, what's the Seven of Pentacles? You was a gift to this person as well. Yeah, the Seven of Pentacles is you're being guided. 909 on the timer. This person knows that you're in the Seven of Pentacles energy, but you're being guided to more money. Yeah, this per you're manifesting right now. Yeah, this person could be trying to come in and trap you with another baby as well. And they're looking you up, steady stalking you. They see good luck keeps happening to you. The more good luck you get, the more bad luck they receive is also what I'm picking up on. <clears throat> Gotta light this instant again. Yeah, you could be single. Somebody want to come towards you and see what's happening. He ain't about to play around with you. He on your ass again. <laughs> 9.47 on a timer. Somebody could like you out here. They could be on your ass again. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What's this King of Wands? 
your gifts. This King of Wands, like I said, they 10 o'clock on the timer. They know you have money or you know how to get money or you're very abundant or something like that. They know that you have gifts. They know you have abilities to manifest. Because, you know, you've seen that manifest card, 10, 12 on the timer. So, yeah, this King of Wands knows that you have money, you have gifts, you have abilities. And they're watching because there's something about timing. They're watching to see what time is this going to happen for you? When is something going to take off for you? That's why they're trying to avoid not paying you. Yeah, what's the Nine of Pentacles? Mm-hmm. Nine of Pentacles for the collective, please. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, this person was very short term. They wanted something long term, 1043 on the timer, but it was very short term. It was very long, short lived is what I was getting up on. So yeah, with the nine of pentacles, whoever you are, you was with this person short term. And now that you're not with this person, you're headed to the ten of cups and you're in, you're in your nine of pentacles energy. I'm sorry for stuttering. What is everything? This person could be stuttering a lot. They could be really nervous. Yeah, they said everything is fine, but it's not with the equal give and take. This person is getting played out here. They're not open to receiving or giving. They don't want to do that. They don't want to give. They just want to receive. They're a taker. If you watch that video, this person, it sounds like the same person. They're a taker, not a giver. This person never gave you equal give and take. They didn't want to share. Yeah. Four of Pentacles. They might try to think they hold some kind of authority. Like I said, this could be a father figure, a baby daddy, a, a baby father, a husband, an ex-husband, something like that. With the Four of Pentacles, this person feels like they can hold on to it. They have the like the authority to do that. But they also know that you hold a lot of authority. You're a boss. You have a very powerful position as well. They don't really know how to challenge you or compel to the situation or respond. They know that you're choosing peace in the solution and situation. They know that you're going to choose peace over conflict. 11.55 on the timer. Page of Swords who's watching. Strategy. This person is watching you. But I tell you, 12.03. 1, 2, 3 on the timer. <laughs> this person is watching you being very strategic on how they come towards you or how you move. Yeah, strategy. They're trying to come up with some kind of strategy, some kind of plan. They might try to give you half of what they owe you. They might try to come back and breadcrumb you or something like that. I don't even think you want the money though. 1220 on a timer. Clarify the sun. 1223 on a timer. What's the sun? Yeah, the sun. This person's been enlightened that you're moving on up to the top. This person knows that you're going places with your life. You really don't need their chump change or their child support or whatever this is. They see that you're growing and you're rising and you have the everything's unfolding. 12.45 on a timer. With the six of wands, you took some leadership and everything's unfolding in your, in your life. They see beautiful things unfolding for you. Yeah, what's the six of wands, Holy Spirit? Everything's on the table. Whatever you did, you laid some shit on the table. 12.55 on a timer. You laid some shit on the table. You said what it was. You made it very clear of who you are. Period. Okay, what's the ten of swords? Movement. This person's mad because you have a lot of movement. They're jealous of you as well. They don't want to see you come up. Pretty much. And that's why they, they don't want to give you the money. They're like, ha, 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 I'm going to keep the money. 13, 13 on the timer. They think you're being funny by keeping it. But really, you don't give a fuck. Harmony, ten of swords. This person's not okay, but you're, you got a lot of harmony. They want to put you in a ten of swords energy by, by holding back from giving you this money. By being strategic and watching you. They think they're being funny by holding on to something. Ha, ha, I got their money, but I'm going to hold on to it. Because they feel like they got this power, this authority, devil energy, Capricorn energy. But they know you hold a lot of power and authority. So they're also kind of afraid to come towards you at the same time. Clarify what's the badass being. Yeah, this person can't limit you. And they're not a great match. But they know you're going to meet your great match. But this person could have tried to limit you. Make you feel like you wasn't good enough. Saving faces. They out here trying to save these hoes. 1404. Trying to keep these hoes happy. Keep the karmics happy. Mm -hmm. You can be some kind of influencer. You can speak to the public as well. Period. Okay, a couple more. Clarify temperance. Why is this person taking a slow speed time? Or they know that you're an angel as well. Or someone could be playing on your heart string, trying to play you out here. Yeah, signs. They're taking a slow speed time to figure out when is the best sign to come in and do this. They're trying to wait for some kind of sign, some kind of clue. Something to let them know that it's okay to come towards you. Something like that. They want to try to do this before you get a new beginning if you haven't already started one. 1444. Okay, we're going to go to another deck. Okay, okay. Looking good. We're going to use the Alice in Wonderland. What's going on all in the golden afternoon for the collective? What 
is my collective need to know. We're going to clarify guidance, authority, strategy, moving up on the table. New beginnings, timing, short term, give and take, saving faces. Okay. What's the energy? Okay, we got 15, 18 on the timer. Messages for the rabbit. Service to the animal world. Yeah, this person want to send you a message. I feel like they're a fucking animal. You could be a life, you could be, your birthday could be on the 15th of any month as well. What's guidance? Clarify guidance for the collective. What is the guidance from the children of the night? What is the guidance? Thank you. Yeah, all must have, all must have prizes. Trying to please everyone. Yeah, this person is trying to please everybody. They're trying to make sure everybody's happy. They're trying to make, they care about what people think about them. Yeah, you're, it's always tea time. Spill that tea, eternity, endless moment. Yeah, cop that tea, bitch catch it. That's what I'm hearing. Your eternity, endless moments, reputation. Your reputation is always protected. You could be 26 or your birthday could be on the 13th of any month as well. You're on a new level. You're not even chasing this person, thinking about this person, worried about this person. Like... What is the gifts for the collective? What is gifts? What does this person got to say? What is the energy for the collective? It's a couple. We're just going to take this one. Uncertainty. Choose who you become. Gifts. This person's mad because you get to choose who you want to become. They know you're very diverse and very talented. God gave you many gifts and they're afraid of which one they're going to, which one you're going to show next. Which one's going to pay you the most money. <laughs> That's also what I'm getting. You could be 39 years old as well. Yep. What's the timing card? Somebody's in deep regret, a moment of regret, nostalgia, idealistic, the past, fearing that you've made a mistake. This person knows they made a mistake by keeping your child support money, hiding the checks from you, not being there for you. So they know karma is right now. Karma is right around the corner with the timing card. Clarify timing. So yeah, this person's in deep regret at this time. Probably make this video in deep regret for hiding your money or something like that. Yeah, they're in regret. The timing card. This is happening right now. Karma. They're watching to see what kind of karma they're going to get. Yep, their birthday could be on the 16th of any month. You could be a life path number 12. Or your birthday could be the 12th of any month. You need to lead the way. Be a leader. Show others how it's done. You can help others, period. This person sees that you're helping others as well. And you're showing them how it's done. And this, that's why I said this person is very jealous of you. They have a lot of growing up to do. 1756. You, they could be, the birthday could be on the 17th. Or they could be 17 years old. Who knows? They wanted to grow and experience rejection of um, premutual youth. So basically, this person feels rejected. They need to grow up. They have a lot of growing to do. They look a lot older than they are. What's short term? I feel like you cut this person off because they were very immature. Believe. They know that you believe in God and have a lot of faith with the Lord. You see how your crown is kind of tilted? Fix your crown. They know that you're the queen out here. 1830 on the timer. Yeah, strange encounters. They know that you could talk to the dead, talk to the beloved, talk to your spirit team. They know that if they try to come towards you, it's going to be short term. I wonder what will happen next. Yeah. You could be a life path number two confirmation. Ready to adventure, participate of change, pause before action. You can be 37, nature, communication. You're very alignment with your um, crown chakra, your intuition. You could be a Pisces. Flower energy, fairy energy, elemental message. So pay attention to the messages that spirit is trying to give you, 1902. What's give and take? What's the give and take card, Holy Spirit? Clarify give and take for the collective. What else does my collective need to know? Give and take. Ooh. We're going to do that again. I don't like how that feel. I'm going to shuffle them this way. What's give and take for the collective Holy Spirit? What's give and take? Oh. They don't want to act right. Somebody don't want to talk. They don't want us to know. What's the give and take Holy Spirit? Thank you. It's a lot. It's just way too many. I don't like that. It's like six cards. Even though I probably should keep them, but... 
Okay, you could have six people coming towards you. You could have somebody trying to confuse you too or throw you off balance or something. Holy Spirit, what's the equal give and take? What is the give and take card? Thank you. Whew, you gotta keep, you gotta make it do it. Somebody might wanna make you do something against your will. Yeah, I want to be a queen. You cut this person off, 2011, because you wanna be a queen, 33, period. You could be 33 years old as well. Starting your servantry. Declaring freedom, passing the test. You clear you obviously you passed the test. I'm so excited for you. 2022. You could have passed the test back in 2022 with this person. You could have learned something back in 2022 that it wasn't equal give and take, that they were trying to play you from the start. Period. You've seen the signs and synchronicities and walked away and had a new beginning. Ooh. 2037 on the timer. What's the sign card, Holy Spirit? Clarify the signs. Yeah, set your course. It could be 22 as well. No where you wish to go hate to plan no sorry know where you wish to go have a plan to in the right direction so plan something out but make sure you go in the right direction period i cannot make this up with the signs spirit is guiding you where to go next to have your new beginning you're being guided away from this person whether they pay you or not they're going to jail anyway but you're being guided away from this person 21 21 21 savage <laughs> You're being very savage with this person as well. Very cutthroat. Kind of how they treated you. You're giving them a taste of their own medicine. 21, 21 on the timer again. The beginning. Yeah, such a curious dream. Grounding. Returning to reality. Coming home. Yeah, you got a new beginning. You coming home. I'm hearing, help me on my journey. Help me on my way. Oh, Lord, help me on my journey. Help me on my way. There you go, period. You tell God, you finna help me on my journey. Help me on my way. 2052 on the timer, you lead the way. God is leading the way. Look at that. Pay attention, collective. Open your eyes. I don't need you on no other app, period. God is leading the way for you. Let's go. You shine bright like a candle. Ha, shine bright like a diamond. 2208. You will make it through this. You can be 36 years old as well. You're going to make it through. Somebody might want to send you a message, though. I feel like it's this person because they're in deep regret. Clock time. You told them. You got 24 seconds. 22, 22 on the timer. You gave them 24 seconds and you better not step. Yeah, time, pressure, in a rush. This person feels like they run out of time. You applying all that pressure. 22, 23. This person feels like they got to be in a rush. Their birthday can be the 14th. <clears throat> Their birthday can be the 14th of any month or yours. <sighs> but this person know they think they're wasting your time. They cannot waste your time. And whatever you do or say applies a lot of pressure. This person can be in a rush, feeling kind of worried. Yeah, what's it say? You could be 20 years old as well. Your birthday can be the 20th of any month. Never jam today. Promises that will never come to be. Empty words. Not living in the now. This person's a liar. You could be 35 or they could be 35, 2307. All in the going afternoon. Something's all in the going afternoon. Your inspiration, creative spark, imagination, conception. This person's mad because how you view things and then you're very imaginative. You're very creative and you hold a lot of inspiration. 23, 23 on the timer. Period. And you shine bright like a diamond. You're going to make it through whatever you're going through. And because we're using, because a lot of cats are coming out. Yeah, keep your temper. Don't allow anger to rule you. This person might try to make you mad or piss you off as well. They could be 20 or you could be 20 or your birthday could be on the 20th of any month. Life is brief, bright, beautiful, and it's yours to live. Mo 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 mobility. Morbility, I'm sorry. You could be 42 or they could be 42. 23, 53. So yeah, this person is very jealous of like your stability, your beautiful light, how you lighten up others. You, you can control your anger. You're not a mad person. You're not a mad max. You're not a Debbie Downer as well. This person holds a lot of anger, a lot of grudges, and they're just mad at you because you don't do that. That's just not who you are. So let's pull a couple cat messages on this person since we got the cats. What is the cat messages for the collective? We got three. We're only going to take them three. At the top of the deck, we have small steps every day. Yeah, you're taking smaller steps every day to your destiny, 24, 24. You're walking right into your destiny each and every day. And that's why they're jealous of you. They're mad, 24, 24. Do your best and forget the rest. Yeah, forget this person. This person don't want to see you do good. They don't want to do right by you. Fuck them. A little encouragement goes a long way. This person wasn't very encouraging, 24, 45. You encourage yourself. Look at yourself say, self, 
you a badass being self, you gonna make it, period. Inhale courage and exhale fear. This person knows you hold a lot of courage and strength. And you're not afraid to move on. You're not afraid to say what's on your mind. You're not afraid to try something new as well. Okay, collective, let's see what else we're going to do. We're going to do, let's do a couple more. Let's just pour the tea leaf because the tea, mm, let's not do the tea leaf. Let's see what else we got to know. Pull a couple messages like this. You know, it's a trap. This person wants to come back in and try to trap you. They want to burden you. They want to make you feel stuck like them. Yeah, this person feels like shit and they're a jackass. I cannot make this up. <laughs> they're doing love spells on you things to try to bring you back to them trying to use that control that authority surprise if they know where you live they might pop up at your house or try to come to your job yeah they're mad because you're having a brand new beginning like i said and they're not and you're very blessed and they're not they know that you're very blessed you got new beginnings yeah surprise they might try to pop up at your house come to your job yeah these are their true emotions <laughs> Yeah, forgiveness. This person might want to ask you for forgiveness. 26 on 6. They're losing sleep over this. Worry. Replaying events. They're thinking about you way too hard. Mm -hmm. They're very sorry, but it's in reverse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this person's rejected. Or they're afraid if they come towards you, you're going to reject them. I know why. I see why you would, Collective. I would just move on. Yeah. You have a lot of inspiration. You might be inspiring this person as well to do better or to be a better person. They want to tell you that they love you. I feel like that's some bullshit. That's just what they, you know, they want to act like they're praying, meditating and healing. And they want to come towards you like they've changed. They're a better person. But really, it's a love spell. They're doing spells on you, collective. Yeah, they want to tell you that they miss you. I got I miss you twice. Ooh, this person's holding on way too tight. Holding on way too tight, watching you, being very strategic. These cards are falling. Confirmation. This person's all over the place. 2702 on the timer. Okay. Let's just shuffle and kind of see what comes out. Yep, I feel like this person's in deep regret. They should have, like, just played their cards better. You know, they should have treated you like you were worth something. You know, this person could be a psycho, a serial killer, crazy, obsessed lover, won't let you go. I'm telling you, Collective, be careful. This person is crazy. 27, 27. They miss you. Reckless love sex. They could be having sex with the same sex. You're just having a lot of reckless sex. Yeah, they made a secret love child, but they want to come back towards you. Let's get it. Holy Spirit, let's speak. You're learning right now. This person is learning a lot from you. And they're fed up with what you got to say. You walked away from this person. You were fed up. One of the two. I feel like it's this person, though. Yeah, you left this person hanging. No closure, no contact. You left this person on red. 37, 57 was for the collective. Yeah, they might want to come back and try to pop some kind of question. They might try to come back and marry you, like I said. Try to marry you to have control over you. They're drinking a lot, thinking a lot. Very toxic lifestyle. Stuck with the karmics, karmic babies. They have a love-hate relationship with you. They really don't love you. They just, they love you when they're sober and they hate you when they're drunk or either they love you when they're drunk and they hate the fuck out of you when they're sober but they're suffering in silence and you need to move in silence as well if this person's stalking you as well they're very crazy and obsessed so pay attention and they see that you're very blessed in a lot of ways god is coming through for you this person's very fucking shady 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 watch out bad credit debt unemployed this person ain't got no job 2843 they want to come towards you for money they're going to make you a promise. Remember that card that said broken promises, lies. They're making secret accounts to keep up with you. Confirmation. What else is going on for the collective? Yeah, they need you. This person needs you. They're off and on, hot and cold, very detached, ghosted. This person might come in and ghost you. One leg in, one leg out kind of energy. They could be facing a lot of legal issues and legal matters. Divorce, property, cr criminal paternity, child support, traffic tickets. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. I feel like you could have been off and on with this person in the past a lot. Yeah, this person knows you're being divinely guided away from them. They're very aware of that. And they just want you to help them out with legal issues, karmic babies, money, drug addictions, sex addictions. Yeah, you're moving on, letting go. You're free. 29, 29 39. Yeah, you're free out here, collective. You don't care about no child support or whatever they got to say. A fake wedding, a fake ring. 
You don't care. This person's GPS is in reverse. They can't find you. They don't know where you're at. This person is very insecure as well. Yeah, this person knows that you meet people's expectations. 29, 59. They know that you meet their expectations, but they don't know how to handle you. And they're doing love spells to make you feel like they meet your expectations. You see what I'm saying? Pay attention. Love spells, reckless sex, love, karmic love, child, legal matters. I'm going to put in regret. Made a karmic love baby going through legal matters. I'm going to put that. You're scribing to the top. You're focused on your business. You could be a content creator or in the spotlight of some type. Yeah, you definitely turned your back on this person. You walked away. You walked away for good. You're happily single, doing you right now. You're dating, stress-free, setting goals, career focus. Mm -hmm. 30, 42 on the timer. Whoa. Yeah, this person could be married too. And healing. Shot clock, 24 hours. You're healing. They, they're watching you heal. They're in deep regret while you're healing. Mm -hmm. You followed your bliss. You did what made you happy. You loved yourself. You turned your back. You walked away. Okay, what else for the collective? A couple more, please. Yeah, GPS, they trying to find you. They trying to figure out where you're at. Seduce. It's a trap. They're trying to find you so they can try to set some kind of trap for you, collective. Trap you with a baby. Trap you with a fake marriage. Trap you, set you up with something. A fake message of love is coming through. This person's hopeful that you're going to fall for it. Pisces energy, you're very intuitive. You know what's going on. Scorpio energy, you ended something. But they're hopeful that they can come back around. You're focused on yourself, self-love. Don't forget to like and subscribe.